I'm Michelle. I'm the Children's Librarian at the Sheridan County Public Library System, and welcome to another story time. Today I'm doing The Wizard, the Fairy, and the Magic Chicken by Helen Lester, illustrated by Lynn Munzinger. This is one of my favorite books. It goes like this. I'm just warning you ahead there's a pickle. It's not where you think it is. There once lived a wizard, a fairy, and a magic chicken. Each thought, I am the greatest in the world, and each was very jealous of the other two. My wand has a moon on it, said the wizard. My wand has a star, said the fairy. My wand has a pickle on it, said the magic chicken. A pickle. I can kiss a pig, said the wizard, and turn it into a bicycle. I guess that's a good thing to be able to do. That's us into the fairy. I can kiss a bicycle and turn it into a bowl of soup with a chicken in it. I can do better than that, said the magic chicken. I can kiss a bowl of soup and turn it into a singing frog. Not sure how helpful that is. Each one always tried to outdo the other. I can make a hairy monster with sharp teeth, said the wizard. Oh, that's kind of scary. I can make a bumpy monster with nine legs, said the fairy. Uh-oh, what's the chicken gonna do? I can make a dotted monster with buggly eyes, said the magic chicken. The monsters glared at the magicians and loudly said, Grumph. The very first time the magicians agreed, Run for your lives, they said. I will make a cloud to hide behind, said the wizard. But that didn't stop the monsters. I'll make thunder to scare them, said the fairy. But the monsters were not frightened. Uh-oh, what's the chicken gonna do? I will make lightning and that will make them go away, said the magic chicken. But they would not go away, nothing worked. We better, said the wizard. Try something, said the fairy. Together, said the magic chicken. Are you ready? I'm gonna turn the page. They chanted, one, two, three, go. And the cloud and the thunder and lightning came together and suddenly it rained. It rained so hard that the monsters got so wet they shrank until they were very little monsters and not scary at all. We did it, cheered the wizard, the fairy, and the magic chicken. I must say, though, said the wizard, my cloud made the rain. Well, said the fairy, it was because of my thunder, but not without my lightning, said the magic chicken. There once lived a wizard, a fairy, and a magic chicken. They argued a lot, but deep down they were very good friends. And that's the story of the wizard, the fairy, and the magic chicken. I'm so glad you joined me. I hope you enjoyed the story. You brighten my day, and I'll see you next time. Bye.